So here comes the elimination. This is the part I absolutely hate. I got 20 beautiful girls and 15 passes. How the hell am I gonna decide who goes home after one night? Hello, 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 beautiful ladies. John, was there, I'm not a rocket scientist here, but I'm looking. And I know there was 20 of us, so it looks like there's about 19 right now. Are we missing somebody? Uh. You know what, boss? I don't think Courtney's gonna make it tonight. It's unreal. There's no way. How do you sleep through a nomination? All right, so here we go. Some of us may have had a better time than others, right? <laughs> However, this is the part that sucks. I've got to let some people stay and some people got to go. And so we're gonna start right now, right? John, if you'll hand me that first pass. There it was. Um, the first person, I will call her my lady in red. Megan, would you come down here? Me and Brad have just magical chemistry. We are made for each other. Would you keep your tallness, hotness, and sexy <laughs> legness in this house and continue to rock my world? You know it. Awesome. <laughs> Megan annoys the crap out of me. She thinks she's cute and sexy. I just want to slap the crap out of her. I just find this girl absolutely sexy, and she will be my sex kitten. Daisy, would you come down here, please? When Brett called me his little sex kitten, I was like, This is real simple for me. Destiny, would you come down here, please? All in a row. I get a pass, Daisy gets a pass, Destiny gets a pass. VIP girls are all staying. The next girl, I think we have something very in common. We discussed it tonight. And in the short amount of time that we got to speak, I felt a good connection and a reason to continue. Aubrey, would you come down here, please? Will you stay here and continue to rock my world? I can't wait to. All right, here we go. Peyton, would you come down here, please? Would you continue to stay here and rock my world? Like no other. And you got cool rock pants. Ina, Roxy, Corey, Jessica, Sarah. I just like this person. Catherine, will you come down here? Excuse me. Will you stay here and continue to rock my world? I'd love to. Awesome. I know he's an equal opportunity guy, but she's kind of old. Like, are you really into that? This girl, if I feel they could get over their germophobia, they could be hot and awesome. Christy Joe, would you come down here, please? I got a pass. I wasn't all aggressive towards him, and he still is into me, because he said he's here for love, not lust. After watching me kiss all the girls in the house, would you be able to stay in this house and continue to rock my world? Absolutely. Right. Let's make you mouthwash. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little suspicious that Christy Joe doesn't want to kiss him, and she's telling everybody that she's a germaphobe. She obviously isn't here for Brett. Nikki, would you come down, please? You have a little bit of punk thing going on, too. Kind of cool. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. I find this girl extremely interesting. And my curiosity has got me fired up to see where it could possibly go. Angelique, would you come down here, please? I felt a spiritual connection when you were the first to take your shirt off. <laughs> <laughs> would you continue to stay in this house and rock my world? Angelique. Bless her heart, but I mean, come on. Are you serious? I mean, seriously. This is the part I hate. I've got the last pass. He has one pass left. And I'm afraid he's gonna give it to one of the VIP girls, Aaron. I'm thinking I'm going home. I'm going home, and I'm bummed. This is the part I hate. And I'm sorry we had so little time to spend for everyone here tonight. My heart is absolutely pounding when I'm standing up there. I'm letting go of some people who potentially could be very important in my life. But with such little time, I got to let them go. I've got one pass left. If I went home tonight, I'd be bummed out. I really would. I'd, I'd be bummed out. I'm just kind of sitting back here, like, holding my ass cheeks together, hoping everything's cool. I would be shocked if I went home tonight. I don't think it's a possibility, and I'm not really worried about it. John, if you would, I've got the last pass. This girl, I was pretty sure was going to be my party buddy. I saw something there that could be fun, that could be interesting. Jackie, will you come down here, please? Then I'm like, I thought I had a guaranteed spot. I didn't even think I was going home. Would you continue to stay in this house and rock my world? Can I tell you one thing before? 
Okay. I'm so nervous right now. Before I, before you came out here, I, I wanted to go home. Because I was scared and I'm nervous and I have really bad anxiety. And then you came out and you're having fun with everyone and listening to you and how genu genuine you are. I don't want to leave. I do want to stay. Is she bipolar? Is she schizophrenic? If there's something in your gut that's saying you don't want to be there, then you should probably let another girl have a chance. If you're nervous because there is also other beautiful girls here that I didn't get to spend as much time with as I would have liked to, I just want to make sure that you really want to be here because I don't want to let one of them go and then tomorrow you say to me I want to go home because I'm gonna feel sick in my stomach if I let one of these beautiful girls go home that I didn't get to spend the time with that I did you. Then I think it would be better if I would go home and give another girl a chance. I'm sorry. That's fine. It's okay. Give me a hug. I'm glad. Your honesty is awesome. I'm sorry. I love this. And you're I know, and I'm not even going to say your Torian's here because we it, nothing ended. We just, I think we made a great bond and a great friendship. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Bye. Bye, Jackie. I got scared. I get really bad anxiety, and I can't stop. I know I won't regret going home. That was completely unexpected, and so obviously Jackie. Uh, well, we don't need that anymore. So, obviously, after that, I've got room for one more. There's four of us standing here, and we all want that pass. I want that pass so bad. That was completely unexpected, and so, obviously, Jackie, uh, well, we don't need that anymore. Obviously, after that, I've got room for one more. Jackie backpedals herself right out the door. And now Brett still has one pass left. I'm surprised that it passed out because literally my legs were shaking. Amber, if you would come down here, please. Yeah. Amber, would you be willing to stay in this house? <gasps> oh my God. And continue to rock my world. Obviously, I don't have a pass with me right now because it's okay. It's Is that cool? <laughs> yeah. All right. Awesome. Can I hug you? Yes, you may. Yay! Wait. <laughs> I feel like I totally dodged a big silver bullet. I have a second chance, and I am motivated, and I'm going for what I want, and that's Brad. For the rest of the girls here, this is the worst part of what I'm doing here, but it's also the best part because it gets down to what we're all here for is to hopefully find love this time around, right? So would you all come down here, those that are tours about to end here, because I'd like to say goodbye. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. I mean that. Loser. First one eliminated. <laughs> Bye, Great babies. meeting you. You look beautiful, really and thank you for coming out. I don't really want to go home, but at the same time, you know, if we didn't have a connection, we just didn't have a connection. Is Nikki Six available? <laughs> Aaron. What's going on? Let me tell you, when I meet somebody and I feel that they've got so much more in their life that they're going to do and so many other people that they're going to meet, but I mean that. No, I'm not saying it as a cop out. I'm saying it for real. Erin is a stunningly beautiful girl, but she's a young, young person. But you have to have someone who has a stronger personality or they won't last long in this nutball house. Believe me, in the end, it will be for the better. OK? I mean that. When he let Aaron go, I realized he was looking for more than just like a pretty face. And that's a good thing, because beauty is only skin deep, you know? Brett, I'm completely confused and blown away by your decision. And I think a lot of people feel the same way. I feel that America is going to think that you made the wrong decision. But I'm going to move on with my life, and you move on with yours. So obviously, we have a situation here with Courtney. We are not going to boot her or physically move her out of her bed. We got to make sure she's safe tonight. So can somebody sleep with you? <laughs> so when Courtney wakes up, Will one of you please tell her that her tour has ended? Mm. Everybody, you want to come down? Uh, delicious bread's brew. Are we ready to rock this house? Woo!